When you offer a discretionary rate different to that generated by RMS, you will need to perform a rate override. Recent changes in RMS make overriding rates easier, with more options, and most importantly deals with all the peripheral elements of the rate, such as taxes, in a reliable and efficient manner. Now, clicking on Base Rate or Total Rate will take you to this screen. In this column you can manually override the rate for one or more nights. Alternatively, enter a rate in this box to apply it to every night of the reservation. Make sure that each night that is included in this rate override has been checked. Use this checkbox to select all, and then choose the Apply to Selected button to process the change. In the case where a discretionary rate has been offered for the stay, use the Override Total Rate option. Enter the total for the stay in this field. Check this box and choose Apply to Selected. This divides the total rate by the number of nights and populates the new nightly rate in this column. Quick, easy and efficient. You will note that whenever a rate has been overridden, the font will change to red. If the rate was overridden in a previous version of RMS, these columns will be yellowed out and the rate override function disabled. To process a further override, follow these steps. Click on the Reset to Auto Rate icon Close this screen and then reopen it. You now have full access to the rate override functions. As always, if you prefer that certain members of staff do not have access to this feature, it can be disabled in security profiles. This new method makes overriding rates quicker, easier and offers enhanced system integrity.